y'all welcome back to my channel my name is misty and the channel's name of course is speculative magpie and hi guys it's been a while hasn't it <laughs> it's been a few days at least maybe a week or two more um it's been a rough month um had a bit of a health scare at the beginning of the month um where i had to stay out of work and go get tested for COVID because I was pretty sick. And while I had all the symptoms, luckily I didn't have actually COVID. So that was good. <laughs> um, that pretty much sucked. I still have a bit of a cough. So if that happens, I'm sorry. And I promise it's not COVID, although I'm pretty sure we can't get it through the screens and everything. Um, also, I've been feeling a bit, you know, overwhelmed <laughs> by a lot of stuff lately. Um, being out sick for so long, coming back to booktube and seeing like 99 notifications <laughs> of everything I've missed, it's been real hard for me to get caught back up. So, and get back in touch with everybody and see what everybody's going on but it's the end of the month I've still been reading so I have some uh, book reviews to do soon um, so that'll be fun I got three physical book reviews and then I'm going to do a mixed media review cuz with me being sick and everything, I have listened to like two audiobooks. Now, I don't normally listen to audiobooks because I don't like being read to or anything, but um, I had some credits on Audible because my husband likes Audible. And I just downloaded several books and, and listened to them. So I figured I'd do those, the, the, the two audiobooks I did and the two um, ebooks I read, I do all in one post just to, you know, for just so I'm not flooding <laughs> with all these different reviews and just so y'all have something to um, look at. I also have some book mail and yeah, I know I said I wasn't going to be ordering any books because I was going to be on a book freeze, but you know, when you're sick and not feeling good and kind of stressy and depressy, you need that little shot of dopamine that only book mail can give to you. But, um, so the first thing I got was, I'm, I'm not going to do an unboxing because a lot of people have done an unboxing, but I ordered my first only ever Nightworms, um, like subscription box and that was really cool and I got the November um, Dark Harvest ones and I got the two books from there which is Wormwood and a Jedi Summer with the Magnetic Kid. Now from reading the back of these, these are both coming of age-esque horror books maybe. I'm not quite sure about this one. This one seems supernatural, kind of, you know, Stranger Things-ish. Well, this one seems more, um, Deliverance, maybe? I don't know. We'll see. It seems strange. But, um, I didn't realize that these two are autographed by the authors, which is really cool. Um, I think that nightworms is a pretty cool subscription box you get two to three books you get like a like a tea a coffee or a hot chocolate thing going on and you get some stickers and some bookmarks um i just did the one thing from them and it was a lot of fun i don't know if i'd like subscribe subscribe but you know when i think about it i might purchase one of the boxes just to get some books that maybe I wouldn't necessarily buy. Plus, they're all indie books, which is really cool. So, you know, you're supporting indie authors, which I think is really cool. Um, also, um, I don't have it in yet, but I ordered my first Hunter Shea book. Um, I know everybody's reading Creature and everything, but 
for some reason, I went with Ghost Mine. <laughs> it just sounded interesting, and I can't wait for it to come in. It's taking a little while, but, you know, I'm really excited to read my first Hunter Shea book, so that'll be cool. And then I ordered this trilogy of books. Um, it's called the Motherless Child Trilogy. It's by Glenn Hirschberg, something like that. Um, this is the first book. Now, basically, it's about these two women that um, basically become in the sights of this, like, rock star vampire kind of guy and how even though they're vampires they're still like they each have a child that they have to care for and they have to run away from this this vampire that they call um the whistler and it just sounded really cool i actually read the synopsis for Nothing to Devour, which was the third book. And I was like, I have to read that. And then I realized it's the third book. So I had to go and find The Motherless Child, which is book one, and then Good Girls, which is book two. So yeah, um, it's just one of those things where I got hyper-focused on Nothing to Devour and needed to get the other three books. It's just the way my brain works sometimes. It's like, I really have to read that book, so I have to get all the others. Um, so, yeah, that's my little book mail. Um, like I said, not quite in the best of headspace right now. Um, hopefully things will settle down soon. I am in a pretty good place right now as far as mentality-wise goes. So I'm going to try to get... Um, a couple of book reviews up right now um, simply because I can right now <laughs> I don't know if they'll all be released soon but um, yeah I'm still doing the evil a thon by Kesha from Kesha's book cemetery that's that's a lot of fun most of my books this month are from that um, although they're not the ones that I most of them are not the ones I put in the um, uh, evil Athon to be red pile. <laughs> There's been a lot of changes. I still have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven books up there, but I've read three so far. So four of the books. Um, so yeah, that's what's going on. And thank you for sticking around, even though I haven't been here. I appreciate it very much. Um, like I said in the beginning, it's going to be very sporadic with me um, as far as uploading. Some weeks there'll be like five videos, one a day, and some weeks it'll be like maybe no videos. And I'm sorry about that, guys, but that's just the way it works. <laughs> so I will talk to you guys later, and I hope you have a really good day, and... I hope I see you again where we can talk some more about some books and things. Bye-bye.